afternoon, just after, after about 12 o'clock, our deputies, along with the city of Charleston Police Department, responded to a disturbance at a residence at 3625 Savannah Highway here in the Red Top area, Johns Island Red Top. The information we have is that a female ran outside of the residence with a male half, and the information we also have is that that male half had a f uh, firearm in his possession, a long gun. Um, at some point, the female was brought back inside of the residence with a male subject, and uh, we responded to our units along with City of Charleston police officers. Um, our SWAT team is also on scene along with our negotiators team and several, several of our assets. Uh, we have since been able to make contact with the female. She is now outside of the residence. And uh, the information that we've learned at this point is that there are two juveniles inside the residence as well. Um, I don't have the exact ages of these juveniles, but my understanding is one juvenile is now out of the residence. And we still have officers on scene. This is still developing. This is very fluid. Uh, we are under the belief that there is still a juvenile inside the house with the male barricaded subject. As a result of this, we've completely shut down Savannah Highway around this area. Um, we are rerouting all northbound and southbound Savannah Highway traffic up and down Main Road and through Beast Ferry trying to get that flowing uh, as much as we can. Um, we have cautioned the general area to stay away from this location. The surrounding businesses have also been cautioned. We've, we've uh, to the best of our ability, controlled access to and from these surrounding businesses. So the woman and one child are no longer in the home, just to verify, and you believe the man... The adult, yes, the adult woman and the child, one child is out of the residence. It is our belief at this time that we still have one juvenile inside the house with a male. Should people who live around this area be a little bit worried? Um, you said, you know, people should not be, you caution people to stay away from this area, but should people be a little concerned? Well, uh, you know, we're doing everything we can. We've got officers posted on the roadway behind this residence, which is Old Charleston Highway, as well as here on the main highway, Savannah Highway. And, uh, you know, we've got officers posted to make sure that there's no individuals that are in that, that line of fire of that residence. Anything else? I think that's it. I think we just, you know, we're asking the public to please bear with us and, and be patient as far as this traffic. Our ultimate goal is to make sure that everybody comes out of this safely. Is that your chopper? We do have our helicopter flying over as well as the drone. And like I said, uh, the city of Charleston Police Department has been helping us for quite a while here. Lastly, how did you find out about this? Did someone in the house call you all? We, I, I don't. I know that we had a number of 911 calls. We had a number of calls to dispatch, um, some of which were telling us about the situation and about the man being armed. I'm not sure at one point, at what point, whether or not it was the female inside.